All right, so I realized I didn't show this in uh, the video from yesterday, but there's a reason why I didn't. Um, I went to get it, and it wasn't here. Um, <laughs> long story short, my son uh, <clears throat> used it, and I didn't know it. But um, so there's the chain that I, uh, I used to clean out the inside of my tank. I just took one end and uh, wrapped it around a rag and then I dropped, you know, I lowered the rest of the chain right down into the tank to where I held basically onto this end of the, the chain and flipped it upside down, sideways, you know, any any direction you could possibly think of and uh, it did a real good job um, and I did it numerous times I mean we're talking I don't know how many times numerous times you know it ain't gonna work the first time it ain't gonna work the second time numerous times um, once you do you know shake this all around and move it and everything like that I'd say <clears throat> you know five ten minutes at a time um, take the chain out and also what I did was I took my shop back okay and I had an air hose from my air compressor that was left over and I you know just put it in the end of the, the air compressor right there okay or the um, geez the shop back and I just slid it right down into the, uh, the gas tank. I stood the gas tank up on end. <clears throat> I had the uh, pickcock and everything like that out of it. I'm sorry, I should have done a video of it, but I just really didn't think about it. But uh, if that helps out somebody in any way, um, that's definitely a good way to uh, clean out um, your gas tank for your motorcycle. And just shop back it out and and you think it's got it you think you got it all said and done you know put some gas down in there and uh, you know seal it up first put your gas down in there uh, shake it all around you know basically rinse the inside of it out and um, take and pour it back out of the out of the tank down by where the pitcock would have been into um, into a funnel or whatnot and have like a white rag, you know, a uh, white piece of cloth. And that'll grab, uh, you know, what what dust particles of the, the rust and everything like that. And, um, you know, and do it again, you know, until uh, it becomes clear. But you'll know, you'll know when it's good and you'll know when it's bad. Um, well, about all I can tell you. <clears throat> some people say use ball bearings I didn't like the idea of ball bearings because of um, possibly making dents to the tank so that's why I went against that idea so there you go God bless take care I'm out of here